Hey everyone, Jeff Sarver from The Practical Drummer here. I want to show you a cool 4-4 triplet groove, shuffle groove, but with three variations, okay? So the groove is going to be uh, basically with, I'm going to do a rolling triplet feel here. So one ta ta two ta ta three so all the middle triplets are, are taken out, okay? Basic uh, triplet feel, shuffle feel that you usually play. But the bass drum is going to be on the one, the last triplet of one, and then the last triplet of two, but with the open hi-hat here. So because I'm going to play the quarter notes with the left foot, if I hit the last triplet of two, one, two, 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 that automatically creates a ch sound, right? Because it's closing on three. If I hit on the, the last triplet of two and it closes on three, it gives you that crisp sound. So if I just do the hands, Okay, snare drum on two and four. One. Bass drum, one, last triplet of one, and then the last triplet of two with the left hand on the hi-hat. Two, three, four. Okay, so that's the basic groove. I'm adding in some ghost notes in there. You can try that as well. Uh, if you play just the basic uh, groove, you can add some ghost notes in. Okay, so I'm actually hitting one ta ta two ta ta three ta. Okay, so that's kind of it. Don't worry about that. If you want to try it in, great. But I want to get the gist of this because I'm going to show you two variations of this groove that are uh, displaced uh, the quarter note triplet and then the displaced quarter note triplet, which I showed you in the last video. Uh, but now I'm adding in a different groove with the wah. Okay, so there's no bass drum after three. Okay, the last bass drum is on the last triplet of two. So one, two, again. Okay, so if I want to do the uh, displaced beat that I showed you last time, it's one ta ta, two ta ta, three ta ta, four ta ta. Okay? Okay, so now if I want to add in that bass drum, it's one ta ta, two ta ta, two ta ta. So it's going to be dance around one ta ta, two ta ta. That's the bass drum. Okay, so there's that. And then to just reverse, if I do the quarter note triplet on the beat and just do hand to hand triplets. Okay, so it's one, two, three, two, three. so that actually the left hand already is playing the the last triplet of two. So instead of on the snare, just bring it up to there. So those are the three groups. Again, the bass drum is the same, the snare drum is the same, except for a couple of the ghost notes. Uh, we're not gonna talk about that right now, but if you feel like you can add them in, great. It just fattens it up. But the key is to hold the same bass drum pattern and also this uh, left hand hi-hat on the last triplet of two and go in and out of this uh, groove, right? So changing up at will. I'm gonna try that right now to keep it consistent, but only change the ride pattern, okay?
So I'll start with the regular, then I'll go to the displaced quarter note triplet, and then I'll go to the quarter note triplet, okay? So those three, and I'll kind of play a few measures of each of those. Then we'll go into a fill, okay? One, two, three. Okay, get that? So basically, I think I missed one bass drum on the, la the last triplet of one on one of those. Uh, but again, I'm just coming up with this on the spot. Uh, I thought about this about 10 minutes ago, sat down, brrr, practiced it a little bit, and then push record. Uh, because I want to. part of what I want to sh show you all is when you have an idea, get down to the drum space and try to flesh it out, okay? And I like to push play because you get to see me try to fumble around with it a little bit if I don't have it right. And all my videos have that. Making mistakes is part of practice. I want to show that. I want to show just the polished end of it. I want to show the underbelly of the beast, if you will, right? So one more time, a little bit more up to speed. So that was slow, da, 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 right? I want to go, da, da, okay, one, two, three. Okay, so that's that. So I got that pretty well. So again, mix and match through this. Uh, when you're playing a triplet groove in a song, you could play this upbeat, displaced triplet feel in the chorus or in the solo. Uh, and you can mix and match. You can uh, do this in soloing as well. It's pretty cool. So a fill I want to show you is kind of a jazzy fill, a fusion fill. Uh, it's a little bit of different sticking. So here it is. What I want to do, it's a two measure fill. It is, you can do it either one measure or two measures, but I'm going to show you two measures. The, it's a nine, a nine, nine uh, stroke grouping, okay? So it's uh, right, left, right, left, left, right, left, right, left, right. That's it. So there's nine, so it's a bar of three, four. Nine triplets is one bar of three, four, right? Because there's three to each quarter note. If I count it out, one, ta, ta, two, ta, ta. Back to one. One, two, three. So I have to hit a to get back to one, okay? So I want to actually bring the, I'm going to bring the ride symbol up on one, ta, ta, two, ta, ta, one, ta, ta, two, ta, ta. So it's falling in line again with our uh, last triplet of two, right? Okay, so it sounds kind of cool. But, so again, it's right, left, right, left, left, right, and then left, right, left. So, one, ta, ta, two, ta, ta, three, ta, ta, one. Okay, so there's only one double in there. One, ta, ta, two, Ta, ta, three, ta, ta, okay? But if we apply this to four, four, okay? So we're gonna play a measure of three, four, then it's gonna start again on beat four, right? Which is then gonna start again on beat three of the next measure. And then we have to lop it off. Uh, three, ta, ta, four, ta, ta, one, okay? Slow. One, ta, ta, three, ta, ta, three, ta, ta, four, ta, ta, That's up to speed. Okay, just lost my stick. So that's it, right? So that's the rhythm. Uh, it's just right, left, right, left, left, right, left, right, left, back to back to the the first, the next nine 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 stroke grouping. Okay, but if we're in four four, it's gonna start on the one. It's gonna restart on the four, and it's gonna then restart on the three. But you have to lop it off. 
to get back to the one or else it would go to two of the next measure, right? But I'm gonna add a little bit different challenge. Instead of the right hand coming down to here after, uh, so any of the non-accent notes, I'm just gonna bring them to the tom. One, two, three, four. Okay, you see that? So again, that is a uh, two measure fill using a three, four rhythm. So it creates a polyrhythm, okay? Not quite three, but it's two and a half. So you have to lop it off at the end as, as I showed you. So if we were to add some of these together, uh, why don't I just play, you know, uh, a couple measures, a few measures of each groove and then do this fill and we'll end with that, okay? Three. Okay? So I did four measures of the straight, and then four measures of the, and then I did two measures of, and then I went into that two measure uh, fill. So again, it was, it was, that was a three measure phrase right there. Again, I'm just showing you to, so you can hear it. Uh, you could do it as a one measure phrase if you want to do that. So basically that would be, you'd have to improvise a little bit, but it would be one, two, three, two, See that? Instead of uh, starting it again on four, you just go four times on one. Okay, that's kind of a cool one measure phrase anyway. Okay, up to speed. Okay. So again, sky's the limit with this. I'm showing you a different kind of sticking this time. Uh, a little bit more parallel kind of sticking where you're adding a left, a double left in there or a right hand kind of feel, right hand lead kind of feel. Try it out and post a comment. Uh, hopefully this video is, uh, is valuable to you and takes your playing to the next level. Again, you want to strive for the groove to be consistent with the bass drum, da da ba 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 da da ba ba with the open hi-hat nice and crisp, okay? Try that out, post a comment, love to hear it. Take care.